everybody. <laughs> All right, guys. I am really, really excited to be here today. And I think I want to do a little experiment with you for my own selfish reasons. I'm standing here in front of an incredible crowd of science lovers here on the National Mall in DC in the pouring rain you came out to support this cause. I can see the White House right there in the background. I think what I wanna do is I wanna take like the biggest selfie ever. So do you think you guys could smile for me? All right, now I want you to do the same thing. Everybody take out your phones. The incredible technology that you have in your hand, these mini computers built and based upon science. And take yourself a huge group selfie. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, now don't forget to tag those photos. March for Science and Earth Day 2017. And remember guys, nothing is untouched by science. It is everywhere. And it pops up in places that you'd least expect. You know, art is at the root of much of our understanding about science. Yeah. It's Da Vinci's illustrations of the human body. It's Charles Darwin's sketches of biodiversity in the Galapagos. And, yeah! And science has produced great art, as our next speaker, the poet Jane Hirschfield, can attest to.